Hi, I'm Mike of Boxing Strength TV. Today I got a video for you guys of just my two cents on a matchup that's coming up. Uh, Jeff Horn versus Terrence Crawford uh, for the uh, WBO belt, I think. I think it's June 9th at the MGM Grand. Uh, and uh, basically, you know, my two cents on this whole situation, uh, you know, I went and looked at some other prediction videos, but I just read the headline and it didn't click. Because a lot of people are saying it's actually going to be a tough fight for Terrence Crawford. That's fucking crazy. That's madness. Terrence Crawford's going to kick Jeff Horn's ass. He's going to beat him in any position. He's going to beat him in every round. He's going to beat him every minute, every second. He's probably going to stop him within six to eight rounds. You know, six, eight or under for sure. If it does go 12 rounds, uh, Horn's just tougher than I thought and going to be a punching bag for all 12 rounds. So that's my prediction there, guys. Jeff, uh, Jeff Horn, good fighter, did beat Manny Pacquiao. They should have stopped the night. Any good commission, if it wasn't in Australia, should have stopped the fight after the ninth round. Uh, you know, he was really beat up by a 38-year-old congressman who's running a country. He probably had a few week camp. So, yeah, no disrespect to Jeff Horn. <laughs> but uh, Terrence Crawford's just going to put an ass whooping on him. It is what it is. Terrence Crawford's the number one pound for pound in the world, fighter in the world for a reason. He's on a collision course with Earl Spence Jr. That shit's got to happen. That shit is going to be just like Anthony Joshua Deontay Wilder. It's going to be a big fight. I don't care about boxing politics. They have to make that fight happen. And uh, pretty much that's it. That's my prediction. Oh, and another thing. Um, I listened to The Boxing Clinic. I'll post it below his YouTube channel. He brought up uh, Terrence Crawford's going to fight on a fucking app. Are you kidding me? It's not going to be on ESPN June 9th. It's going to be on an app. This is going to top rank and ESPN. I'm going to tweet this at both of you guys. Can you please just put it on regular ESPN? You'll get great ratings. Terrence Crawford's the shit. Promote this guy. You put Belcher on ESPN, you put Lomachenko, you're not going to put Terrence Crawford on it. You're going to put him on the fucking app. So then nobody will watch it. Are you kidding me? I'm a huge Terrence Crawford fan. I don't watch top rank. I watch PBC. You know what I mean? I don't watch a lot of fights on ESPN. I actually watched a Ryan Garcia fight because that guy's going to be a superstar. Uh, but, like, I'm really, I'm a big, I'm going to, I really was very excited to watch Terrence Crawford on regular ESPN so I don't have to go on my computer and download an app. Okay? Because he's a star. And that's the only reason I'm going to watch top ranked fights because of Terrence Crawford. Because he's one of the best fucking fighters in the world. He's a good dude. He, I mean,. He's always posting shit on his Instagram with his family. He's helping out kids in fucking Africa. He's just a good dude. And he's number one pound for pound fighter in the world. 32-0. and 0. Come on. Give this guy some fucking love, somebody. Anyways, that's it. It's going to happen. He's going to fight fucking Earl Spence soon enough. So anyways, that's my two cents. Sorry I'm a little angry. I'm always angry. But uh, Terrence Crawford, number one pound for pound. Get off that ESPN app. Let's get it on regular ESPN. And he's kicking Jeff Horn's ass. Thanks for watching.